Hello, people. I'm Mike Jr. the second, and I got some other people here. Who who are you guys? I'm Iron Fury. You may know me from such playthroughs as Iron Fury plays a bunch of shit. Now let's get this show on the road. And who are we with today? Uh, this here is Dogongo from uh, Raster Master Games. You might know me from uh, the wonderful playthroughs such as Tomb Raider, Legend of Zelda: Skyward Sword, any of those other awesome games we play. Awesome. All right, we're here to play X Men online. Fuck you, X Men. Right. For the uh, PS3. Uh, does this one actually have an Xbox version? I think so. I think it does. So. All right. So we're playing the PS3 version. Awesome. Lots of fun. We're playing um, expert. Playing as, yeah. Yeah, we're playing expert. We're playing the USA version of the game because we're in America. America. Um. We are playing the USA version of the game, like I said, and we're playing on expert mode, so we might get our asses kicked. We'll probably die so many times that we'll just get annoyed. Yes, but we're going to have so, fun while we fucking do it. I guess with that, let's get started. Yeah. In the 21st century, evil mutants led by Magneto aim to destroy the world. <laughs> Humans I can't unhear that, god damn it. <laughs> the only hope. X-Men. He does oh, sound exactly no. like him, doesn't he? Why is why is Go and save man? the city. <laughs> okay, time for Colossus to fuck shit up. We again. have fun now. Oh yeah. There's so many sandals. Oh god. I know. And none of them <laughs> are actually the size. Stop trying to take my quarters. <laughs> <laughs> and then we have these random guys with bazookas. Who nobody knows who they are. Or rocket launchers. If we were playing Metal Slug, they would be announced Rocket Launcher! Rocket Launcher. <laughs> oh shit, he blew me out of the sky. You know what? Fuck this. <laughs> <laughs> the Colossus Roar. <laughs> because Colossus take no shit from no goddamn robot. Colossus is eater of worlds. Actually, um, Colossus and Nightcrawler probably have my two favorite mutant powers in this game. Yeah. They're pretty cool. Colossus is just great, not only because of the roar, but because it can clear out so many people at once. Hmm. I just find Nightcrawler's funny, like, teleporting so fast you can kill people. Yes. <laughs> I guess in expert mode you only get one uh, credit. You do? Oh wow. Dang. And you have to keep pre you have to keep pressing continue. Ah, uh, okay. Random green and purple thing. Who apparently want us to talk to their fists. And I, I think I I I think um the score remains the same either way. That kind of hurt. <laughs> yeah, your score remains the same. Wow. So your score still isn't affected. That's good. So, uh, Mike, you want to explain how this game works, or do you want me to do that for you? Uh, I haven't played the game as much, so you'd probably do a lot better explaining it. Okay, so um, controls are pretty simple. You jump with X, you can attack with square or circle, and you can use your mutant power with the triangle button. Since this is the US version of the game, mutant power takes away from health. In the Japanese version of the game, you have a set amount of number of times you can use the mutant power, but it doesn't actually hurt you to use it. Now I have a question about that. That was my first question when I first heard that. Was that, does it, is that dependent on uh, like after you die? Are you allowed to get everything back or is it during the whole playthrough? Um, I'm assuming it's after you die. Yeah. Yeah. I don't, because in the, I know in like I said, in this version, it's done by health. But I think it, I think it's every t every time you die. Which, if you were playing the arcade version in an actual arcade machine, you know, that <laughs> still doesn't make things all that easy. Yeah, no. But in this particular version, on a technicality, that just makes the Japanese version of the game easier. You have to... Okay. Although I suppose it doesn't really matter all too much anyway, since this is a port of the game, you know, lives are pretty much meaningless. Basically. Imagine if they did microtransactions like that now. 
god. <laughs> you gotta pay 25 cents <laughs> to play your fucking... Oh, it would never work. Oh, yeah, never. Depending on how they did it. I mean, if you could get it no, for free. It, it really? It would never work. It would never work on a home console. I guess. Nah, really not. Of course. Hi, well, we'll turn. Fuck you. <laughs> you don't get to talk. You're not as hot as you think you are. You don't have any real powers. You just use a flamethrower. <laughs> Although in the movie they want you to believe that the actually. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Fuck you. Colossus will destroy you. <laughs> Colossus may be steel type, but he is not weak to fire. <laughs> Colossus will jab you to death. <laughs> My father was eaten by a volcano. <laughs> you shall pay. <laughs> you shall pay for his death. My name is Anil Montalaya. <laughs> <laughs> It's your goddamn phone. <laughs> Isn't that phone. You? Is that your phone? That is my phone. Oh, okay. Uh, excuse me for a moment. I have to take this. Okay. It's your goddamn phone. My phone. We'll beat the shit out of him. That's okay. <laughs> so yeah, let's talk about how much that Nightcrawler is a piece of shit. I know, right? All you do is fucking teleport. You're useful power. You're fucking useless. Let's beat the fucking shit out of him. <laughs> uh. You're fucking worthless. <laughs> Hey, don't tell me to move on. I'll beat the fuck out of you, too. You can't do nothing. Damn you, letters. Stop taunting me. Don't you talk. Hey, who said you could fucking talk, bitch? You're fucking dead. I'm gonna beat the fuck. Oh, Ow. shit. <laughs> what the? That just killed us? I didn't know they did that. Uh-oh. He better get back. Oh, God. Will that kick him out? I don't know. Uh... Oh, God. Uh... Push X as soon as you get back. Push X. Jalen? <laughs> Jalen, uh, X button now, X button now. You might want to come back. Uh. Uh, buddy. Could he push start and come back? Yeah, I think I think he can still come back. Okay. He just he just loses his score. Uh, well, hmm, wow. <laughs> That's why we started this right high score. <laughs> I'm back. Yeah, he's back. Okay, yeah. Apparently, if you wait too long, uh, the Nazis decide to drop the bombs on you. Oh, wow. Yes. That's is that is that in the other modes of the game? Uh, I think so. Okay. But yeah, if you, if you wait too long, Obama drone bombs you. <laughs> That's fucked up. Oh. Fucking hilarious, though. Actually, no, this came out in the 90s. Clinton bombed you. <laughs> Was it uh, early 90s or late 90s? Early. Early? Fact, okay. I can tell you for a fact that this incarnation of the X Men. Was um, seen in Spider-Man and His Amazing Friends, which was a cartoon in the 80s. Ah, yes. so that means it could also so be this Cold is War. The 80s X -Men. So you could also say Cold War, <laughs> the communists. Actually, I think the plot of this uh, whole game was based off a pilot TV show for the X-Men. Was it? Yes, I think it was actually. Wow. I think it was called uh, Pride of the X-Men. Yeah, which I've seen. What happened? Yes, which I actually uh, have seen that. My um, one of my cousins had that on a VHS tape when we were kids. Wow, awesome! I caught the the newer version of the X Men when I was a kid. The version I'm most familiar with is the '90s cartoon. Yeah. yeah. Which, in my opinion, is still the best version. I think I think mine was the 2000 version. It showed up on Kids oh. WB Cartoon Network. Yeah, X Men Evolution. Yeah. Yeah, that was the one. Which was. Wasn't I that liked done it. by the four kids group or like uh I don't think it was four kids, no. Was well, it? Maybe not four kids, but it like they had some of the voice actors that they had for that. Yeah, maybe. One or two, I think. Like I know um the guy who did Wolverine's voice was the same guy who uh who did Piccolo's voice in the ocean dub of Dragon Ball. Oh yeah. uh, oh the ocean dub? Oh yeah. The guy who yeah. And I think he's been in uh he, I know he, I know that guy's been around forever, though. Yeah, but uh, you're talking about the Ocean version, so we're not thinking of uh, Christopher Sabat. Yeah. 
It's, uh, I don't know the other guy's name. He's the guy that kind of sounded like this. Yeah. You know what? He was also in Beast Wars. He was. He was! He did the voice, he did the voice in Rat Trap in Beast Wars. Oh, yeah. I've actually been able to catch that on Netflix. That's awesome. I love rewatching that show. He did a, that guy did a lot of voices for shows from when I was a kid. Yeah. Like, I don't remember all of them offhand, but I just, like, I instantly recognized that guy's voice. Yeah. He was in a lot of stuff. Uh, like, he's just I, I one of those guys that I can, like, I, oh, that's that guy. Mm -hmm. Yeah. There's a lot like, of guys like that out there. The only other guys, like, from my childhood that really hold that position are guys like Jim Cummings. Yeah. Mm hmm. Like, I can recognize Jim Cummings' voice anywhere. Like, uh, he's. He, he also, um. I know Jim Cummings was also recently doing the, uh. commercials for Thomas English Muffins. <laughs> <laughs> what a way he we've was. gone. <laughs> he was. He was. For Thomas English Muffins. That's funny. <laughs> Did you want an like, English muffin like after like that, may I ask? What? Did you want an English muffin after that, may I ask? <laughs> Only if I'm having eggs Benedict or poached eggs with it. Hmm. Generally, I'm not the biggest fan of English muffins on their own. Yeah, but same with poached eggs or, or eggs Benedict, that is, like, amazing and required. <laughs> well, not so much just poached eggs, but eggs Benedict. Son of a bitch, now my phone's ringing. Nothing! Darn you, fat blob man. You know, I bet he called Fury just to mess with him. Yeah, no. Fuck this shit! I kill you now. <laughs> okay, so apparently I, I, now it's canon that the one who called you was this fat guy to get you away from the game, Fury. Yes. <laughs> the blob called me. He told me, Colossus, you are not truly eater of worlds. I am. And Colossus said, No. Fuck you. I am eater of worlds. I destroy you. You are nothing but Jabba. <laughs> In fact. Colossus is ready. He hit you with leg drop. Actually, that's a double axe hand up. I say, I hit you with the leg. Fuck this shit. I'm going to hit you with a leg drop before you die. There, I hit you with leg drop. Leg drop. Fuck you. Did it. I am better than Andre Giant ever was. X Men, X Men. We have been taken by Magneto. Oh, uh, you got something on your head However, there? Uh, I want to get that base on Island M. Hold on, we're about to just the best shit eating grin ever. <laughs> <laughs> I love that shit eating grin. That that He's just like, oh yeah, I got the weirdest boner right now. <laughs> <laughs> and we're probably on the most recognizable level in the game. Probably. Well, because this was the level, and I, I said this in my playthrough of the game, but this was the level that um, that was usually demoed a lot in the actual arcades. Yeah. Oh, like was it? Ah. That it was the demo level for when nobody was playing. This was the level that came up the most. Ah. Do you remember who was playing it? Or who, um, what the characters were, actually? Just curious. I think, had, I think they had, like, Wolverine, Cyclops, Nightcrawler, and Colossus. Yeah, they're probably probably the most recognizable from the show, so they put those guys or up. Or maybe Storm was in there? I don't know. Mm. I think they mixed and matched it, but I know this level came up a lot. Yeah. That'd be cool having different demo reels. Well, they do that for games. Yeah, that's true. I mean, game, not every demo is the same. Yeah. I mean, they, they definitely cycle through a set number of them, but they usually have at least, you know, three or four of them. Yeah. Not just a constant loop with the same one over and over again. Yeah. Although sometimes you see that too. Yeah. Especially the really fun, pathetic ones you can find. <laughs> okay, Colossus is getting tired of this bullshit from dinosaurs. I will show you that not only am I the eater of worlds, but I am the comet that fucks you up and makes you extinct. <laughs> <laughs> I was almost starting to box that line. You were? You got close there. Yes. Fuck you. I'm Jimmy King, I'll crown your ass. Bon bonus points for anybody who gets that reference. Uh. 
Well, I don't think. Well, I don't know. I don't think you guys are wrestling fans, right? Nah, not really. Do you remember Ready to Rumble? Yes. Jimmy King. Oh. Jimmy King, he's gonna crown you. His finishing move was the double axe handle off the top rope. Yes, 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 that's right. I will crown you! So far, this is going like a metric fluff ton better than what? The what the oh hell? Oh my okay, god! Man. So many people. Oh god! As I was saying, this was going so much better. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Shut the hell up! You're ruining shit. Oh, this was going so much better than my playthrough. My playthrough was a piece of shit. This one was great. Lag. Lag. <laughs> oh. Good going, game. Way uh -oh, to be a lagget. Uh oh, uh -oh. everybody, shut up. <laughs> X-Men, welcome to die! Yes, you heard that right. Welcome to die. <laughs> welcome to die. I've always wanted to know, who the hell do who do the voices for some of these guys? Like, did they th think that was a good idea at the time, or did the video game developers tell them to do that? I'm pretty sure they just took it off. <laughs> yeah. Also, it's Windigo, aka the Abominable Sperm Man. <laughs> yes. That is a good way to put it. Actually, I don't even know who the fuck Windigo is. Like, in the comics or anything. Yeah, I haven't seen him in I can't think of him in any of the TV shows, either. Are, 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 are you a... Do you read the comics at all, Jalen? Uh, yeah, I read a bit of comics. Um, if I remember correctly, Windigo's like... He's like a werewolf or something. I'm not sure who he, like, is either, but, like, he can, like, infect people and, like, turn them into Wendigos, too. Oh, so he's kind of like a vampire werewolf, in a sense? Yeah. Oh, wait, no, werewolves do that, too, never mind. But, yeah, basically. That's kind of lame. I know. Did they um, not really do much with him? It's X-Men. Let's have a werewolf. <laughs> what about Wolverine? That's kind of close, right? <laughs> What's funny is, like, wolverines are, like, goofy-ass looking animals. Yeah, they are. The little, short little like, fuckers. I mean, they're threatening, but they don't look threatening. Yeah. They had him in, uh, Scott Pilgrim. They just look like Go rats. and rescue yeah. Kitty from the cave. They're mean little fuckers, though. Go and rescue Kitty from the cage. Oh, my God. It's Iron Man! Times <laughs> a thousand! Oh, God. Hey, Nightcaller, can't you just, like, go to where Magneto is right now? Hey, Kitty, <laughs> couldn't you just, like, go through the cage? <laughs> um, isn't yeah, isn't her... Uh, no, but I'm saying, uh, Kitty's power is that she can just go through objects at will. I know. Oh, yeah, she can face through stuff. Yeah, she can face through stuff. Can she face so, through the floor, too? Yeah. yeah! Yeah, like, so that one level where we were going down, we could have just phased through. <laughs> this game cannot handle the power of Colossus. <laughs> so far, by the way, I have the highest score. You do. Yeah. Because your superpower is absolutely broken. <laughs> yes, it, is. it can hit everyone around you. <laughs> doesn't I, I, the funny thing is? Isn't Storm like one of the most powerful members of the X Men? And isn't her power in this not that great? Her power in this, I think, is um just shooting a couple of tornadoes forward. Yeah, not really that great. But it's, not, it's, it's nowhere near as useful as Colossus. Yeah, no, that's what I mean. It's like. The best thing about Colossus' power is the fact that it, it's basically like a giant barrier around him, so it's good for enemies that are surrounding him. Yeah. That's the thing, though, is that it gets everything around you, not just not just in front of you, which is what, uh, like that. <laughs> yeah. Nightcrawlers is probably the second best, because it goes across the whole screen. Yeah. Mm. Although, yeah. the only thing about Nightcrawlers is that his is fucking spastic. Yeah. So, yeah. sometimes you might not even hit anything. Mm-hmm. 
Wolverine's is eh, because really the only thing that's good about it is I can hit people from across the screen, but not exactly behind him or anything. Yeah, so Wolverine's power is best used when at the far end of the screen. Yeah. Yeah, Colossus has like an area of effect power kind of thing. God, is this Mario all of a sudden regurgitating children? <laughs> it's Rodan! <laughs> That's okay, I'm gonna end this shit soon enough. <laughs> oh my god, they're back! God damn, she can mate. Fuck this so shit. Bats. Ha, gotcha, little fuck. By the way, we're doing a lot better than I thought we would be. Yeah, we are. I mean, it's probably because of the fact that, you know, we have infinite credits. Yeah, probably. <laughs> I think we'd be down by a few ten dollars right now. I know. <laughs> and now it's this. Whatever this is. I don't even know who the hell it is. <laughs> He's got the weirdest outfit on. It's just a robot. Robot with a pink man face. <laughs> I'll probably look this up later. <laughs> He's got some sort of weird emerald in the middle. Whatever that is. I mean, it's not even like Windigo and says its name. Yeah. You know? I mean, I, I... Like I said, my only experience with X-Men is through the cartoons. Same here. So, if I don't, I mean, I don't recognize everybody. You know, the cartoons only had so many villains in it, and they were, they used the ones that were most well known. Or yeah. Who made the big impact. You know? They had some people here and there, but not really anything big. Like, Sabretooth, Juggernaut, Magneto, Apocalypse. Yeah. The government. <laughs> the government. Well, it's true. It is. Yeah. They are, they are one of the true. antagonists. The government were villains in that show. They were. Which is kind of, it's kind of cool By that the they way, still Storm did that. And, uh, Cyclops just conveniently show up and so does Dazzler. No. I'm glad they got here in time. <laughs> we do all the work and they get the credit. I'm sorry. Yeah, did we... Sorry, I was getting a coffee. How are you guys holding up? <laughs> yeah. Oh, we went to Starbucks. Did you guys want anything? <laughs> Actually, from what I hear, Starbucks coffee is terrible. I have their, like, little special kind of drinks. I don't have, I have their coffee. coffee. Oh god, I just fell off. <laughs> Colossus does not like this world anymore. <laughs> <laughs> what is the point of living? Yes. Colossus no longer cares. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, um, I said this a lot during my run of this game, but these guys so remind me of the goddamn pizza aliens from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oh god, they do. Don't they? <laughs> I'm curious if they did any copy-paste uh -oh. anything. <laughs> boss time. Or mid-boss, anyway. Shut up! <laughs> yes, I'm hitting a woman. <laughs> Colossus helped the mutant patriarch. <laughs> <laughs> Colossus like his mutant privilege. I'll show you tropes versus women. <laughs> <laughs> tropes versus women in gaming? No. Colossus versus women in game. <laughs> Colossus always wins. <laughs> hey baby. Colossus always hard. Hard as steel. <laughs> <laughs> That is one annoying battle, like Death Cry. I know, right? Gets on the ears. It sounds like a dying cat. What? Apparently the trophy. <laughs> apparently, I got. I, I haven't played through this that far, but apparently the trophy that for this for killing her is welcome to die. Why is that not Magneto? Come on. Who knows? That deserve that. That is deservant of Magneto. Who cares? Let's keep playing. Nah, it's all good.
It's funny how they appear from behind you out of nowhere. <laughs> Just like a thousand of them. <laughs> oh, sure. Matt's responding to me now about the about playing this with us. <laughs> I wish I could, but I had to go to work. No, you didn't. I would have made a video as a doctor's note. <laughs> <laughs> you, were you around for that? Uh... No, Jalen wasn't here for that while I was eating Chinese food. Yeah. <laughs> We were saying that, um... Wish I could, instead I have to make sandwiches. <laughs> Too bad Facebook isn't like Skype and I could just tell him he should make me. <laughs> hey, it's the only Sentinel that's actually the size of a Sentinel. I know, right? Oh my god, look at everything on screen. And I'm surprised we've got no lags. And look as it all dies from Colossus. By the way, I think we are almost at the boss. I think we are. Yeah. No, you won't. <laughs> Do you even use that bazooka? Come on. What kills me is Juggernaut isn't bad enough. They had to give him a bazooka. <laughs> I am the Colossus, bitch. Oh, his helmet's off. If we were using Professor X, we could take him out instantly. Okay, seriously. <laughs> that would work. I'm putting pictures in your head of your mother naked. Ah! That's our mother, you idiot. <laughs> By the way, his bazooka shoots out lasers. <laughs> couldn't, couldn't just have it fire missiles. It had to be lasers. Lasers, lasers make everything better. They do. Yep. There, he's dead. Let's go. I'm now coming up with an invention for laser condoms. Nice job. Magneto is over there. Follow me. Well then. Did someone press X? I think I, I did, sorry. Oh, well, look at that. You just skipped out on a cutscene. Oh, the, the, the five seconds we missed. I know, where we would have been told that it was Mystique. Yes, that was my bad. We were fooled. Deceived. <laughs> yes. Now, how did she replicate the chair? Good question. <laughs> I mean, I believe she can't do objects, correct? Yes, yeah, I can. guess she can. Ah! You just had enough of this world? <laughs> <laughs> So, um, I still have the highest score. You do. God, you Wait, have more than me and him. You have a lower score than Jalen. You got a game over, for God's sakes. <laughs> me and Jalen put together don't have a bigger score as you do. I know. That's pretty sad. That is sad. Then again, it's probably because I can do... Holy this. crap. Yeah, that is broken. And Pyro was just mad that we didn't let him get his intro off in the beginning. I know, right? <laughs> So he brought his buddies along. Yes, his fabulous buddies. Yes. We're flaming hot! Hey, it's the paraplegic guild. <laughs> they're like the lollipop guild, but instead of being midgets, they're in wheelchairs. <laughs> About the same size. <laughs> Part of that guild, too? Yes. The paraplegic kill. <laughs> and it's the random Egyptian guys. Okay, I've never even read the comics, and I know these guys are bullshit. <laughs> right. You should have taken your social studies class. I mean, I, listen, I could understand if Apocalypse was in the game, but because at least he's Egyptian. Yeah. Right. But these two guys, and come on, we know the middle one's gonna come. Sooner or later. Imagine if it didn't. How <laughs> fucking that would just bug you. Yep. Okay, buddy, you're about to die. It's like that room in a video game where it has nothing inside of it, and you're just like, "There's got to be something." I know. Did 
Did they even have scythes back in Egyptian times? Come on. Uh, they probably had some kind of similar. I know they didn't shoot lasers, though. <laughs> I know. Though the Egyptian times would have been better if they had lasers. Just saying. Well, I don't know. <laughs> you got a point I there. Mean, if everybody I mean, I had know. lasers. I'm... If everybody had lasers. I know. I mean, only the military and government need lasers. Right. <laughs> That's why we need strict laser control. Yes, laser control. <laughs> Excuse me, is that laser inside of your CD-ROM legal? <laughs> Colossus. Yes. <laughs> I didn't even know I had to... Magneto is planning to attack and there's his awkward his neck. Base. Wow. You must spoil his plan before it's and that too thing late. where someone splooged on his head. <laughs> By the way, to space! For some reason. And yes, we could freely walk around in space. Crazy. All these physics. <laughs> Oxygen? What's that? So, um, we uh, landed in Mr. T Special Sentinel Training Ground. <laughs> <laughs> you know, because he has to have himself all covered in gold. <laughs> Yeah. Oh shit. Wolverine. You just shot me. I don't like that. What are the point of those devices? Here, I'm gonna stick some weird freaking uh, gun. You killed. Uh, the back. <laughs> they have like a guile haircut, don't they? Ah, the paraplegic kill, the paraplegic kill, the paraplegic kill. I don't know how the song goes, but... <laughs> we also have machine guns. Machine guns. Colossus does not care about your paraplegic kill. Palerla. Well, how long do you have to be in the you get to actually get your machine gun? <laughs> um, I've heard that you need to be in there for at least three weeks. You gotta have some background checks, make sure that you're not illegal, and... <laughs> right, right. This yeah. sounds speedy enough. Nothing yes. moves the blob immediately moved. <laughs> oh, and it's, um, the abominable sperm man. Mm -hmm. And it's time to bring back the patriarchy. Now, see, I I'm surprised the fat man did not call you again, Fury. I know. To mess with you on the phone. Yes, he got upset. And he got beat the first time. <laughs> he got beat like the meat he loves to eat. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I did not mean for that to rhyme as well as he did. Oh, that cat call again. Ugh. And it's this thing. The, uh... Might be Master Mold? That makes sense. I don't know. But wasn't Master Mold a Sentinel? Master Mold was a Sentinel, and he got a human form. Oh, did he? Yeah. Also Juggernaut. Yeah. Actually, I remember in the, um, in the cartoon, Colossus... Oh, yeah. Shut up. <laughs> I know in the cartoon, they actually had Colossus fight the Juggernaut, and they actually made him look like they were on even ground. Oh, yeah. Is it actually like that in the comics, or...? I don't know. Um, I'm not comics. sure either, honestly. It's, honestly, it's different. Yeah. It changes like it can change like from a month to like a week. Yeah, you know? no, that's Colossus, comics for you. Continuity, not, red cons. Wasn't Juggernaut a good guy for a while? He was. Um, uh, pretty much everyone like that's the villain X Men has pretty has been like you know joined good side and then just gone back. Well, even even Magneto, same thing, kind of good and turned oh, bad. Oh, just. Uh. Alas. That was Mystique, not Magneto. Magneto no shit. is in another place. Go, X-Men!
Whatever, Gohan. I am Magneto, Master of Magnet. <laughs> <laughs> and on this day, a legend was born. No master of grammar. <laughs> I am Magneto, Master of Magnet. And yet, that's probably still not as bad as uh, the voice acting in the Simpsons arcade game. Oh, God. <laughs> Welcome to my world. <laughs> Sounds nothing like Smithers. Nope. Magneto, master of schoolyard bullying banter. <laughs> or as Matt would say, Magneto, master of rewinding VHS tapes. <laughs> this playthrough is dedicated in the memory of Matt, who couldn't be here with us because he was too busy making a sandwich. Yes. <laughs> Poor guy. And we're gonna act like that means he's dead. Yes. Because <laughs> when you make a sandwich, there's really nothing left. Yeah, your your life is over. Might as well dig your own grave. Oh, I gotta say, that is the best way to go, making a sandwich. Too bad he's not making it for himself. I know, right? <laughs> Kill you, ex-chicken! Matt, master of sandwiches! <laughs> Matt! Ex chicken, master of sandwich. <laughs> you are dead. You are dead. <laughs> Seriously, Magneto, master of school guard bullying band. <laughs> be funny if someone actually joined us now. I know, right? Kill you. Like drop. Magneto is not ready for Colossus. <laughs> Colossus have 24 inch pythons. Colossus slam 7 billion ton blob in front of 20 million Colossus maniacs. Oh, and I'm not here. Oh. That's the game. <laughs> hey, I got a trophy. Expertise. Same here. But yeah, that's the game. Yep. Mag Magneto was defeated. X-Men succeed to rescue Professor and return to Earth with the victory. But still, the battle against threats of evil is something, something, something. No, the game is not over yet. <laughs> um, so that was fun. Yeah, it was. Yeah. It was good. Very fun. A little quickie. So, uh, I know you haven't played this before, Mike. What did you think of it? Uh, I liked it. I mean, it is difficult. It'd be nice if they could have tried making a version of the game where you didn't feel like you were total shit at it. Well, <laughs> we were playing on Expert. Yeah, no, I get that. But I've played the game before myself, and it'd be nice being able to play a version where you didn't feel like... when Every time you keep restarting, you feel like you're a wimp. Yeah, but you gotta remember, too, it is an arcade game, and the whole idea was that they want your money. Oh, yeah, yeah. definitely. I get that. It's just playing it now is definitely I'm different. I'm sure if they made a console version, it would have been a lot easier. Oh, yeah, no. Definitely. Unless but they were... With with a version like this, where it's a port on, an, on a machine, where you don't have to put money in, difficulty's kind of meaningless. Yeah, basically. I mean, that's how games were back then. At least arcade think, games. Galen? Um, I've always liked this game. Uh, it's very fun. Well, I beat him up in general, so. Um, so I guess we should end this off before we keep playing any further, huh? Yeah, probably. <laughs> um, I'm Iron Fury. I'm Mike Jr. the second. I'm oh, sorry. Um, the Gongo. Yes. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> 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 oh, that's a good way to end this off, huh? Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, catch you guys later. Take care. Bye.